is just in. August is hotter than ever at Appalachian Wireless as they are slashing all normal contract pricing on all smartphones by 50% when you sign up for service. Better service, bigger savings. Serving you for the last 25 years at Appalachian Wireless. There was a significant crowd today at the Kmart in Pikeville for a drive-down initiative event aimed at making drivers more safety conscious when dealing with commercial vehicles. What we're doing, this is kind of, kind of a two-part deal with the TAC program, and TAC stands for Ticketing Aggressive Cars and Trucks. The first portion of that's going to be education, and that's largely what we're doing here. That's the way we'd rather do things other than enforcement, just to let people know what it takes to safely cohabitate with the trucks when they're traveling up and down Kentucky's roadways. The car weighs about 3,000 pounds. Compare that to 80,000 pounds. When those two pieces of metal tangle, it's never good. So we're trying to teach people how they can function well around the trucks, rules such as proper distancing, and to make sure whenever you have a truck in front of you, if you can't see their mirrors, then they can't see you. There are many, many blind spots around a truck and we're trying to teach people to stay out of those blind spots. Today's event was aided by the KSR radio show and Matt Jones and their crew doing a live broadcast from the parking lot. Listen, I'm from Eastern Kentucky, so I feel a connection to folks here, and we have a lot of big fans of the show. So I, I always look forward to coming to Eastern Kentucky. It's my favorite week of the tour. You know, we do Prestonsburg, Paintsville, Whitesburg, uh, Hazard, etc., and I, I always look forward to it. Anytime you can bring a public figure like them around, it increases a crowd. And that means that's more people that we have here listening to what we have to say as far as our educational program with the TAC program. Authorities say they will be pulling motorists over for aggressive driving around commercial vehicles. Education at first, but later that education will turn into tickets. Reporting from Pikeville for EKB News, I'm Jackson Latta.